How's it going everyone? I'm Boone and it's time for my freebies roundup for April 2020. And as always, all the links for all the freebies and the tutorials I'm going to be talking about today are in the video description. So for the first freebie, this is a graphics pack from Premium Beat called Retro Wave Graphics Pack. And this is all about Vaporwave and Synthwave design looks, which I have no idea what this is, but my buddy Charles over at Premium Beat actually created a new tutorial that's all about it. It's called uh, the visual styles of the Synthwave and Vaporwave video. So in that he talks about this design look and he shows you how to use all the free assets in this pack. If you've ever used freebies from Premium Beat, Shutterstock or Rocketstock, they're always really high quality, really easy to use. Next up is my YouTube subscribe button Mogurt template for Adobe Premiere Pro. So I created a product this month that is um, six Mogurt templates for Adobe Premiere Pro and I'm actually giving away one of them for free and um, it's this really cool graphic that is essentially just a YouTube subscribe button that you can put on top of your videos in if you're using Adobe Premiere Pro. It's all responsive. Essentially if you change any of the individual elements of the graphic everything else is going to respond accordingly and you can also naturally change the text. So if you're working in a different language, um, that word subscribe, you can um, type in whatever text you want if it's in a different language or if you wanna use the name um, of your channel or whatever text you wanna put in there. It's got notification bells, some thumbs up, uh, play buttons, just go check it out. Next up is a bunch of free historical images from old 19th century books. So I saw this article from No Film School that um, talks about this website that has been cataloging all these old images from these old books and they're all in the public domain naturally so you can use them for whatever you want. So yeah, the collection apparently has images used to illustrate popular authors like Jules Verne and Edgar Allan Poe. The website is oldbookillustrations.com and you can search by different subjects, you can search by the artist, or you can search by book titles. Next up is Crates Glow. This is an After Effects plugin from the guys over at Production Crate. So I've been talking to the folks over there. Um, I think we're gonna do some uh, video reviews on the channel, but they gave me a heads up and let me know that they have a, um, a number of free uh, scripts and plugins for Adobe After Effects on their site. And I was checking them out and this Glow one caught my attention. It looks pretty cool. Um, right now I've been using the Deep Glow plugin from the creators that plug in everything. That's a premium plugin, really, really good plugin. But um, so I'd be interested to try this one out and kind of put those head to head or just compare this one with the After Effects um, default glow, which sucks in my opinion. Last but not least is a free screenwriting ebook from the folks over at No Film School, more specifically a guy named Jason Hellerman. He's a really good writer over there. He's always writing about screenplay um, and writing related topics. More specifically, it's called How to Write a Screenplay During Quarantine. This thing is 100 pages, it's free. By free, I mean you have to give them your email address. And this is a step-by-step -step guide on how to write your screenplay while you're stuck at home. Super fun. What will this book do for you? Immerse you in film script writing theory and practices, teach you to write visually, help you analyze successful screenplays, guide you through writing log lines and treatments, and give you a schedule to write every week. That's probably the most important part because I've tried to do some writing and it's always hard to set aside time to actually get anything done. Um, so I think that's a huge part of it is setting aside a little part of each day or a part of each week to get a number of pages done. Okay, so those are the freebies for April. Uh, regarding tutorials, I only did three this month. So the first was a tutorial about um, my Mogurt template freebie that I created, the YouTube subscribe button. This video just essentially shows you how to use that Mogurt template, like shows you how to install it and shows you how to edit it. And, and I go over how I rigged it out and what you can do with it. Um, I also did a tutorial early on in the month about uh, seven map creation tools for Adobe After Effects. So this focuses on really cool, if you, if you ever wanted to create a map inside of After Effects, it could be really hard. So these are different plugins, um, scripts, and template uh, tools that are gonna help you with that process. And they all do kind of different things. Um, and I take you through them, I show you a few free tools, and then they go up in price from there all the way up to um, the GeoLayers plugin, which is a really, really high-end map creation tool. So go check that tutorial out. 
and I did one tutorial for Premium Beat about working with photos in Adobe Premiere Pro um, and this takes you step by step on what you need to worry about and how to um, you know kind of maximize your workflow when when working with photos in Adobe Premiere Pro things like that you have to worry about like resolution how to keep your images sharp depending on the resolution of your project sequence how to animate those photos and bring them to life how to use different overlays to make things pop and add motion because photos you know they're still images so you have to do a lot of things to them to make them look um, more visually dynamic okay so i'm hoping next month i'll have a lot more tutorials for you i have a lot of stuff planned it's just a matter of having the time to get out and do this stuff you know with the whole coronavirus it's hard to get out um, they're starting to relax the rules here in France so I can go out now and actually do some stuff for longer periods of time. This month it was kind of like you can go out for an hour at a time and you have to have documents filled out. So it's definitely starting to be more lax and I think I'm going to be able to get, get out more and shoot more. Um, I've been wanting to do one, um, my Tuesday tool series, I want to really do at least one a week where I show either and I do a review of either an After Effects tool or I do a gear review. Again, I got a bunch of um, sponsorships from different companies. So I have a bunch of video gear now that I'm gonna be reviewing soon, like my Blackmagic cameras um, and other pieces and parts and accessories. So look for that this month, as well as some of those uh, After Effects tools. I'm gonna be trying to put out uh, a product as well each month. I don't know, maybe, maybe. Um, I did one so far and we'll see how that one goes and if it goes Poorly, I'm, I might not be putting out anymore, but I have so much fun putting together things inside of After Effects like the template projects or creating Mobirts for Adobe Premiere Pro. So um, in each month that I create those products, I'm, I'm going to be trying to give away a freebie in um, these monthly freebie updates like this month was the um, Mobirt template YouTube subscribe button. Uh, next month might be a um, uh, animated bar graph or I don't know what I'm going to do yet, but I need to to pick it soon anyways i hope you enjoyed the video hope you enjoyed the freebies if you did give me a thumbs up and if you want to see more freebies each month be sure to subscribe to my channel and hit that notification bell